Hello friends, this is Kunal Mehta from Make Me Scientific, your host for this video and today I am going to take up a topic that is very important for ICSC 10th graders that is machines and from machines the part that I am going to take up over here are the pulleys and I am going to teach you the mechanical advantage velocity ratio of single fixed pulley, single movable pulley and the tackle block system having one on pulley each with the demonstrations because as I always believe that the demonstrations are the key to understand the physics very well. So let's not waste any time and go to the demonstrations. Here we have a single pulley fixed on a wooden stand. A thin and inextensible rope carrying a load of 100 gram force is made to pass over this fixed pulley. The end of the rope near my fingers is the place where the effort is applied in the downward direction. You can clearly see that the distance moved by the effort is same as the distance moved by the load. So in ideal conditions, displacement of effort to the displacement of load ratio is velocity ratio which turns out to be 1. Let's connect a spring balance at the effort end to measure the magnitude of the effort. And we note that the effort is also 100 gram force. So we can conclude that the fixed pulley has a mechanical advantage of 1. And this is used to simply change the direction of effort. Take a thin and inextensible rope having knots at both the ends. Place one of the knots in the hook. Let the rope pass over the single movable pulley attached with a 50 gram force load. Pass the rope from the bottom to keep the effort upwards as shown. Here two ropes or two strands or two tensions are supporting the load whereas effort is balanced by a single tension. So the mechanical advantage is load upon effort. So 2t divided by t, so the mechanical advantage for this pulley will be 2. Carefully note the movement of load and the effort points. We observe that the displacement of the effort is twice than that of the displacement of the load. Which proves that velocity ratio of this single movable pulley is 2. Now let's attach a spring balance to the effort end and measure the magnitude of the effort. We see that the effort is 25 gram force, so the effort is half of the load, hence the single movable pulley acts as a force multiplier. Here I have taken a thin and inextensible rope having knot at only one end. We have a pulley here connected with the 50 gram force load using a thread. We have another pulley which has a bent iron rod for its support. A thread is also passed through this pulley. Pass the rope as shown to make the block and tackle system. Hang the pulley with the hook as shown. Now watch carefully how I make the connection between the tackle and the block.
it's very evident from here that the effort point moves twice the distance as that of the load point so the velocity ratio is 2.